other people. It's just me. As many of you may know if you follow me on Instagram, I have moved Bell Yards. I've moved her up to Ockleyshe, so I thought that the facilities might be better for what we're wanting to do, like lots more eventing and things. I've got a cross country course and that, so um, Bell's just starting to settle in a bit, but um, she's taking it a bit hard. I feel really guilty. But um, she's on the trailer just now. My dad always tried to show you because you can't see. But um, I'm just left the yard. It's a bit further away than our old one. Um, so I'm just away to go pick up Joanna. Just Joanna, not Blondie. Because today I'm going cross country training. Just me and Belle, obviously, not me. <laughs> but um, yeah, so I'm going to pick her up and we're going to go head across to Lindor's because they've reopened and do some cross country training. The reason we're not going together is because we don't have a cameraman. So I'm going to go today and Joanna's going to go tomorrow. So I can video her tomorrow. I was expecting Belle to be a bit of a pain whilst loading because um, she can be, she's known to be a bit of a pain whilst loading. But I think because we've moved, she thinks that we're somewhere else. She's always better coming back from a place. Like she loads straight away. And, and when I put her away to go in the trailer, she was like, get me on, like she proper rammed on. And I was like, she thinks we're going home. I feel really bad. Anyway, because she loaded really well, um, I'm early, so. I just thought I'd stop at the side of the road beside a nice wood for a wee minute and do a little hello and why I'm here on my own. And I keep pausing it because there's so many people around and I'm not used to having to film myself in front of people yet. Because it's right beside like a wee fence. Oh, there's a person and his dog. Um, going to walk their dogs in the woods and stuff so uh, there's a lot of people here watching me. <laughs> but I might head off now because I've probably been sitting here for about five minutes so that gives me an extra wee bit of time and I'll just dander along the road slowly because I've got a precious car going in the back and um, I'll catch up with you when I pick up Joanna at Asda. <laughs> it's a bit different. <laughs> Bye! So the team is back together again. Hello everybody! I'm scared! <laughs> oh, oh god! Hello little person. Blondie, is that you? Perhaps. Oh god, where's she gone? Oh, I can walk a hill. She's cool. I'm really warm. I'm hiking. This is so far away. Oh. Look at these views. Oh my god, we're so high up. Tree blocking the way. Oh, it's actually beautiful. It's been two years now. Still walking up this hill. Claire's overtaken me by a few miles. This might be the end of Moody Mayor Diaries. I think I'm gonna collapse. Love to you all. Goodbye. Just in case you think I'm joking, the biggest hill in the entire world. I think I see the ocean. It's definitely the ocean. And we are back everyone. Had a breather. Feeling good, didn't I? All is well. Claire's cantering over a hill behind me. If you see a white splodge, that's her. Looking good, Claire! 
there she goes. Goodbye, Claire. It was nice knowing you. I wonder if you're gonna jump this thing. And again with the ocean, God, it's surrounding us. So here me and Belle are at the start of our cross-country eclipse. I was really, really nervous. I'm like hanging on for dear life. So we just started off over some little jumps and she was a bit sticky, but she was actually going over them, which I was quite surprised by. As you can see at this jump, she does a bit of a weird stride, a bit of a flyer, and I'm kind of just hanging on and not letting her do her thing. But we kind of got there at the end. We went over this one a few times, which you don't really see in the videos, but she was absolutely flying over it by the end. And this is our first time doing a drop like this. <laughs> it was actually going quite well until she just stopped right at the very end of it and wouldn't go down. And she can rear quite bad, so I was started freaking out thinking she's a way to go up with me. So we had a wee turn around and tried again and she went flying off of it, but Joanna, obviously being Joanna, stopped recording. So we didn't get that on camera, but I'll insert a wee picture. Girl bell. Good girl. Oh, keep going. And then over the next one. Keep going. Kick, kick, kick. Good girl. Good girl bell. So far so good. Claire's been doing really well. Belle's super confident today. But she's a way to attempt her very first corner. So let's see how this goes. Woo! <laughs> Good. Like basically last season when things kind of like started running again, I had a lesson of course. And I thought like, oh we'll be fine. She'll be jumping them, no problem. And I mean it when I say like I can get her over that log. Cue the log. It's a small log. Like, I mean it, she would not go over it. And she would like the biggest thing we did was probably like a 50 centimeter jump. I had a competition in the same place the week after. Anyway, the competition was really, 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 really bad. Like, she stopped at basically every jump. But it was all just a learning curve. We had 100 trials a week after, a couple weeks after, and then it was off for the winter. And she obviously came back and, like, retained all that information. And she's been so bold and enthusiastic. I'm so proud of her. I was not expecting that at all. Like, I was not expecting that. So this is day two of cross country training. We are back to Lindor's today. Um, it's me and Blondie. So Claire's came to meet me at the yard. What are you doing, Claire? <laughs> oh God! Why do we keep pretending to be gremlins? Um, anyway, um, 
Yeah, me and Blondie haven't been to cross country training before. We've been to arena eventing, uh, which went really well in August. I know, but she's I, amazing. She's never going to do Yeah, it. no, she is really good. Um, but we only went up to maybe like the 75s, I think. Um, and everything there was like really rustic and like neutral and it wasn't really that scary. So I think seeing all Claire's jumps yesterday, there was like quite a lot of like really big ones, colourful yeah. ones, like yeah, they were ones with ones massive horses attached to the side <laughs> <laughs> so yeah they won't look at you. she'll look she's, she's too keen on jumping yeah she is keen I think once I aim her at the fences she'll be fine when, when I, we went to Oakton she was really um, looky like walking past everything but even Belle was like yeah. that yesterday yeah. I think once they know that they've got a job to do um, yeah. everything goes well so we, uh, I texted Joanna yesterday with uh, all the Scottish BE fixtures Oh yeah, so we'll be booking that in depending on how yeah. today goes. We want to book in Hunter Trials and uh, what else? Pairs. Mm -hmm. So yeah, loads of fun things. Joanna was like, um, can I just see how I get on tomorrow? <laughs> like, no, we're going to Florgan Denny next month. Oh. <laughs> nah, we should be fine. Yeah. We have arrived. Oh, pretty blondie. Pretty blondie. We've taken your surroundings. Yes, yeah, it's very nice. It's so pretty. Hello, cows. My lump, my lovely lady lump. We'll get copyrighted. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I watched back on Joanna's videos from yesterday and she seemed to struggle a lot going up this hill. And we're literally right at the start of it. I'm scared, so I brought back up just in case I need it, <laughs> which I probably will in like literally four minutes or something. Um, starting to get out of breath already. I'll probably have to put the phone away. This is not good for me. I worked hard yesterday. Oh my goodness! Oh my god! That bird was way too close for my liking. Oh, I don't want to do this. My legs are tired from yesterday. <sighs> 12 seconds later. Okay, it's happening. Just keep going. Whoa. Gives you the kick of energy that you need. I'm not far off Blondie now. My legs have sped right up. Whoa. Let's go. Honestly, this is never ending. Gonna have a six pack by the end of this. We're so close. That's it. That's almost done. Don't know if I can make it, let's be honest. I can just sit here and wait for her to be finished. Look at the colour of my cheeks. Great. Let me show you this hill I've just walked up. I swear to God. Down there, you can see everything from up here. It really, is beautiful. It's a much nicer day than we had yesterday. There's literally no wind. It's so nice. Okay, the final stretch has been completed. Now to find a little tiny palomino pony in these woods. Oh, found. Wee. Bye. I thought it looked big from the ground, but like. Not quite that big. Hey, fun times, warming up. Back to me. Oh my goodness. I just wasn't expecting that to happen right now. Oh my god. Fun days we are flying at the weirdest angles. What was I going to say? Oh yeah. It's a lot less stressful being on the ground than it is being on the horse. And Joanna's admitted to me that the jumps that I did yesterday look a lot bigger. When you're on the horse so i guess she's on a 32 pony and i was on a 16 hand horse but still so here is the start of me and blondie's clips um like claire we just started off really small and um, my biggest issue with blondie is trying to keep her steady so you'll hear me in a lot of the clips <laughs> trying to show her saying like whoa steady oh god um she just speeds up so much but i do like that she takes me right into them so i don't need to worry about her refusing usually anyway um and she was going really well here, so I was really looking forward to getting over some of the big jumps. Um, this is me 
galloping down to Claire <laughs> so she didn't have to walk right back up to me but the plan is today just to get her over um, some of the big funny shaped fences and the water complex and the drops because I haven't tried any of that before. Same time. Trap, trap. No, no, no. Steady. Woo! <laughs> Good girl. <laughs> And in this clip you can see exactly why I need to slow her down because look at how fast she wants to go into this gigantic corner. Oh, I literally couldn't do anything but she does just fly over it so that's good. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> that's so funny. <laughs> what the hell? Steady, steady, steady. <laughs> So Joanna's definitely got a better day weather-wise. It's actually roasting, I'm sweating now in my jacket. And the sun's out. The pictures I've taken are absolutely lovely. Better than her one she took of me yesterday. She'll say otherwise, but... <laughs> Blonde day's going so well, obviously, as usual. She's such a brave little bold pony. Honestly, she's unreal. She's just flicking about at everything. We don't know how much cross-country practice that she's done, but... She's like a pro. <laughs> She's so good. I can't wait to get her into pairs. Oh my god, it's going to be actually unreal. Hopefully things are on soon. We are at the cottage now and this drop looks so much bigger than it actually is. So much. <laughs> I love the sound effects. <laughs> How are you feeling? Woo! <laughs> Same reaction as yesterday. I, I can't believe it. That was literally like my first time doing any like, cross country in years. And even still, I did like logs on the ground with my old horse. Yeah. So to be able to do that was like the funnest thing ever. I didn't know what to expect. Like <laughs> going up to the jumps and that and all the funny strides. But oh, she was absolutely flying. It was so good. Yeah, she was good. So much fun. She was fab. Fabby pony. So we're in the car home. Hey, happy smiles all around. So We've good. had such a good couple of days. Eh? Yeah, actually more like than we expected. Us, like, yeah, expected to have like, just so much fun. I know, it was, it was amazing. brilliant. We had such a good day. So but much like big and spooky jumps and everything and like, ah, oh, so yeah, good. Unexpected. So good. But um, I think we're quite feeling quite good for going and doing an event this summer actually. Yeah, I, I didn't think yeah. that like, Either of us would like, we thought we'd like do it and just kind of like hope for the best sort of thing, yeah. but we actually both have a bit of confidence. I know. Then. Maybe Belle will go clear. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, that's a bit uh, optimistic. No. Especially with the ditches. But um, yeah, no, I, we're feeling pretty good about it. Yeah. It's a shame about Scotland's fixtures being um, put off until May though. It just gives us some extra time. Yeah, to do so, so much time to yeah. practice. Like, we'll just keep going to cross country yeah. practice, arena eventing get them so used to it that like we just don't worry when well, we will worry but it won't be <laughs> as scary we were going to go oh sorry um arena eventing this week um but the forklift for the place broke so they couldn't move the jumps into the arena because we thought that was a good first step to go into the arena it felt a bit more secure but yeah. um so we were kind of forced to go to actually to the cross-country field um, yeah. which i'm glad that we did because it was like pushed right out of our comfort zone but they were really good mm -hmm. so next time i think we'll be going like next week or the week after, we'll probably go to uh, Oakdown. Yeah, p yeah, a place called Oakdown. It's just like two minutes yeah. down the road from Lindor's actually, yeah. so it's brilliant. And uh, we'll do some of that. I don't know if we'll be able to vlog it because it's quite difficult having not got a cameraman. Yeah, but hopefully we'll yeah. get some like videos of each yeah. other and we'll see. We'll get lots of uh, yeah. content for our Instagram pages, photos and things. Um, yeah. But not sure if we'll be able to vlog it. But hopefully this gives you guys enough cross country content for a wee while until we start going. Yes. Go Lots of screams and laughs. <laughs> it was so fun. Things. I'm in such a good mood from it all. So good. 
Can't wait to see the pictures and videos later. Must forgive you, and you must forgive.